Good morning, Mrs. Merry Christmas! Woo! <laughs> Look at that Christmas hair. Yay! Yeah? Good morning. You want to cuddle? Cuddle? Merry Christmas from all of us to all of you. Merry Christmas. <laughs> So you joined Mia and I in the kitchen. We were thinking of trying to make something for Daddy that's a little bit Christmassy, a little bit special because for those of you who don't know, Ingmar is keto. So I thought I would just kind of scour the internet, go on YouTube, look for some recipes. I did make him a cake not too long ago that he really, really liked. A blueberry cake cup thing. Yes, Mrs. So I think I'm gonna make him that today. So there's something special for him to eat, but also try and make some other things that I've never made before that might not work out, but why not try that on Christmas Eve? Nothing like leaving it to the last minute. So we're gonna look up some recipes. Let's do it here. Keto cake, cake and mug. Here we go, yummy, yummy. Oh, these look good. Let's see if we can do these. Right, I'll get back to you. I made these with Kirtan yesterday, so poor Ingmar has to come in the kitchen where there's lovely treats like this and Kirtan's cookies over here, and he can't eat any of these. I would find that really difficult. He seems to manage. <laughs> there we go. That doesn't look too bad. It looks edible, so hopefully it tastes good. I'm not sure if it's cooked all the way through, but I'm sure he'll eat it anyway. <laughs> and this one has now sunk in the middle and looks like a complete disaster, but it's the thought that counts. <laughs> Merry Christmas, babe. I'll just show you a tiny bit of the back of Mia, but she's now having her Christmas day bath in the kitchen sink, and she still just about fits. Future Mia, you have permission to kick my butt for showing that on the internet. So happy, Mia. So this is kind of the Christmas look. I'm bundled up in a lot of layers. We've got some lovely biscuits to take. I've got my handbag and I'm not sure if you can see, but yeah, that's a nappy in it. So guys, today is the 24th, it's Christmas Eve, which in Iceland is Christmas Eve, but the first day of Christmas, which is like Christmas day for them. And then tomorrow is Christmas day for us, but the second day of Christmas for people in Iceland. Is that correct? No. <laughs> we just celebrate Christmas Eve. We have Christmas Day. Is you have two days sacred. of Christmas. Christmas Eve is sacred. <laughs> Christmas Day is really sacred. And second Boxing day of day. Christmas. Boxing Day. It's really, really, no, not really sacred, but it's like, it's more chill. But Christmas Day is very holy. four years I'm still trying to figure out what the heck we do here. So today we are, it's midday, just after midday, because we're running late. Um, we're heading down to Ingemar's auntie. Yeah. to attend like the family gathering of the traditional rice pudding Ris feast. The gist of this is that all the family gather and we have rice pudding and there is one person who will have a nut in it, is it an almond? Almond. An almond in their rice pudding and they receive a prize, they're the lucky one and they'll get a little present and then two of the Yola lads, the Santa Clauses, will come and see the children and make jokes and sing to them and wow that looks beautiful where it's like misty or snow. Um, yeah so they'll sing to them and give them a present. So we're not quite sure if Mia will be in on that yet because she might be a bit too young for it but she is going to be hyper and love seeing all the kids and hopefully enjoying rice pudding. So we're all dressed up Yes, yes, oh, yes, <laughs> and we're going to take you along for the day. So we're doing this, then we're heading home, and then later on this evening, we are going for Christmas dinner, or Christmas Eve dinner, <laughs> at Ingemar's sister's house. And tomorrow I will 
destroy the turkey. <laughs> Tomorrow is our turn. These are lovely shoes, but not shoes for trampling through snow in. There's a snowman in that person's garden. Okay, this is commitment to the vlog. I am now going through the snow just to get some footage of how beautiful the park looks because there's a kind of haze. I don't know if it's like the wind or something, I'm not sure, but it is stunning. And the light is gorgeous as well. Oh, we should have walked. We just ran out of time. You know what it's like. is incredible that's one application that stayed all day we are having some snacks because I'm hungry I'm having skiers Mia's having her new German sausage okay <laughs> I'm gonna have a fried egg because I'm really hungry mm. and it's three o'clock and I don't know what time we're eating because six. yeah six o'clock mm -hmm. oh, I can't last that long I might have a little glass of bubbly as well because it's Christmas why not <laughs> Um, I've just put E.T. on TV so we can sit and watch that as a family but it just occurred to me it's kind of Christmas Day here whatever the Viking says um, so I need to organize the presents to take round to Christmas dinner tonight so I better get sorted with all of that and by organize I just mean take them out from underneath the tree Cheers. We're talking about gifts. Me and Sonia have given each other the Christmas gifts before Christmas. And Only Sonia because you ordered what you wanted. <clears throat> and I just got my own gift because I knew you were doing that Now I'm being guilt tripped, <laughs> guilt tripped because of that. Sonia is playing an awesome game of guilt tripping. But let's see what we have in store for her. <laughs> I said, do you have anything you need to wrap? No. Exactly. It's already right. And, and that's my sister's. Ringers. Naughty. He's naughty. He's naughty, isn't he? I am. <laughs> So many presents! Wow! <laughs> it's Christmas present time! It's Christmas yeah. time! <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh dear! Now 
9.25. <gasps> what a party monster. So we have had a wonderful Christmas Eve. Christmas. First day of Christmas, whatever yep. it's called. <laughs> night night from us. Go Merry on Christmas. Clearly yours. Clearly yours. Go on not. Mm. Mm. So Ingemar and I have just sorted out all the presents under the tree. We have some pretty crazy kind of wrapping, covering up going on. <laughs> so um, I'll try and film tomorrow so you get to see what some of this is. But I'll maybe just do a recap afterwards if not. But that's our family presents under the tree and Santa. We have Mia's stocking here, which is obviously huge. <laughs> I bought it so I could take a picture of her in it last year, but then she got ill. Um, I did take one quick picture of her, so it wasn't very good. But anyway, there's <laughs> there's only one item in that stocking, but it's there. And then we have this very subtle thing that I'm hoping she doesn't see. <laughs> I think she's not gonna, I think it'll be fine. But I wonder if you can guess what it is. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> there we go. It is the Ikea kitchen. And I've put a sandwich there for her. <laughs> and then vegetables, cakes and some fish already there. And we've got all of the dishes underneath the tree. So I think we are ready for Christmas morning. I'm not sure how it's going to go because Mia has stayed up very late tonight. Hopefully she'll sleep a little bit later tomorrow morning. But we shall see how it goes and I'll try to film. But I'm so excited because it starts to feel so much more exciting and real when you have a kid. And when, I mean, she doesn't, doesn't have a clue what Christmas is all about. But she's getting a bit more excited about it. So that is just so exciting when you're the parent or around a kid. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going to go to bed now. I wish you a very Merry Christmas from the three of us to all of you. Good night, guys.